everybody welcome back you don't know your boy command brown back with another video now for all you gamers out there especially you guys part of the playstation family you know exactly what this is let's get the box it's the pulse 3d wireless headset right that's what we have here today now this is an awesome headset i mean yeah it's a bit quiet sometimes the bass but not really too bad but i love it the surround sounds incredible trust me it fully immerses in the game i really actually love it but there's a problem with it the materials aren't the best it feels premium fairly robust but it's still plastic and false leather now you're here in the caribbean i personally tend to sweat a lot so sweat salt and heat don't mix and dust too because you know i don't really use ac every single day so yes so here's a problem guys over time the sweat the dust the salt the heat led to this tons of cracking tons of stripping it looks pretty grisly pretty gnarly pretty nasty and of course when i'm gaming sometimes like i'm eating some of this stuff because like it just flakes off and flies all over the place but anyway this video we're going to be changing into one of these right actually going to change the head cups and have them looking brand spanking new again so this is also sort of an unbagging because it didn't really come in a box this is exactly how it came as you can see it's ps5 headset cool i don't know what the hell that means ones <laughs> accessories black i guess that's a brand name i didn't really look at the brand name let's look at the reviews the cost of course because you don't know i'm all about saving money and these are pretty damn good less than 20 bucks and uh, yeah it's what you see what you get pretty much so let's get straight into the unbagging and this is it first impression guys strap that for a second yes this thing feels nice it actually feels a lot more premium than what we get on these I mean they said that it has a layer of gel at the top i guess that's this layer here i like the fact that the part which makes contact actually is not of leather material it's more of a fabric material it actually feels more cool to the touch which i actually very much love and appreciate and yes as you can see it's round about the same height which means should give a good oem feeling on the back here you have the four clips which are supposed to go onto the headset itself and in here seems similar to how it seems in here as well right so fairly standard stuff i actually like the feeling of this material over that feels like this will last a lot longer but we'll definitely see plastic of course for the mounting piece but let's get straight into the bag let's see what else is here that's the left ear cup this is the right air cup. It's the same, similar thing. And let's see, there's a thank you card in here. Let's put that down over there for a second. Thank you card. Yada yada yada. And um, oh, instruction. So this is how simple. I'm all about cheap and easy. <laughs> More time is saved, and time is money, right? So Pretty simple, four steps, you use something flat, credit card, a guitar pick if you have one, which comes in many of the screwdriver sets these days. I'm gonna show you the one that I have, line of buckles, there's four buckles as I showed you on the ear cups themselves. You attach a new pad to the head cup, and then you press it down to secure it. Fairly simple. They also have a video, which they show the link for, which is also useful, but we're going to be doing this raw, live and living color haven't tried this haven't attempted it yet so this is a first hands-on first attempt right here with you guys right so let's get straight into it now before i begin i always recommend everybody everybody whether you're a tech person whether you're an engineer whether you're a computer it tech whatever this is always useful to have around the house right one of these screwdriver sets they're not expensive at all. A lot of these bigger YouTubers speak about iFixit sets and so forth, which I have no doubt are very premium. But 
I'm all about saving money. This was cheap, less than 20 bucks at the time. I got this about a couple years back. I'm not sure if it's on sale, but if I do find it, it's on Amazon, or it was on Amazon, I'll definitely link it in the description below. You guys can check it out. But what we're interested in are these, the guitar picks. So it comes with a plethora of screwdriver fittings. Um, guitar picks, I have no clue what the hell this is. I've never used it before. Um, of course, this is a screwdriver itself. Um, it has an extension. These are elongated tweezers. This, yet again, I've never used this before. <laughs> no clue what that is. Suction cup. These are pry tools. And another extension piece for the screwdriver. This thing has saved me so many times. So many tear downs, so many fixings. But anyway, let's get straight into it. What we care about are these, the guitar picks. Right? As you can see, this one has a bit of wear and tear. This is my trusty go-to pick. This thing has saved me so many times, people. So let's get straight into it. All right, and here we are, right? Going straight into it. I'm not even going to clean up the workspace. I'm not kidding, guys. Literally, literally. While on camera, this thing continued to flake. Look at this. Look at all these little bits and pieces all over the place, right? It's, it's crazy. So yeah, this definitely needs to change. Can't imagine how many of this I actually breathe in. I wouldn't want to see what this does to your lungs, people. So let's do this. No clue which one will work, but this one has the flatter edge. So I'm gonna start out with this one. And they say to just simply put it at the edge and just go around. Ooh, I hear it clicking off, which is good. Heard the first one. Oh, it clicked back in. All right, let me try the other one since this one actually has more of a sloped finish. So, again, more trusty at it again. There we go. There we go. Ah, whoop. <laughs> there we go, people. And while taking it off, look at this. Yeah, this thing is done. This is done, done. Right? This is freaking done. I can't even throw this aside. It's going to cause me so much trouble in cleaning up right now. So, no need for that. Anyone needs to know how this thing looks without the air cups? There you go. Let's get the other side off as well. See, step by step, people, I'm showing you everything. But this is pretty easy to remove. You know what I mean? Pretty simple. This is like one, two, three stuff. And if you don't have one of these, I would imagine a credit card would be just fine. Let's use a corner and you're good to go. There we go. And there it is. My workspace is messy. But I'm not hiding anything from you guys. This is this is how bad this thing gets, depending on the climate. So now I'm putting on one of these now, right? I'm gonna start up with the left side, right? So they say just simply align it. Oh, uh, let's see. So this is it, the smaller side to me, and then I just apparently just press it down. It is pretty tight, people. Like <laughs> I'm a little bit worried right about now. Oops, <laughs> you guys, this thing is so rough. All right, people, this thing was a little tricky, but I figured it out. Had to really and truly come off camera for that. This thing, if you guys decide to get this, I don't know if it's the same for all the other third party replacements, but there is a little finesse to it. You have a two long clips on one side and two shorter clips on the other side, right? This is a right ear cup. Now, this seems a little funny but the long ear cup well the long pieces for the left one was to me called left to left right to right so let's get the orientation right right now it's the same for the right side as well oops <laughs> it's the long side the long clips to you which is here and the shorter clips to away from you all right now I'm gonna be 
flipping it around because I need some leverage here. So what you want to do is to get the shorter clips in first, right? If you're clipping the long clips first, you're gonna have one or two, which pretty much will never go in no matter how hard you press. So try and get in the short clips first. Remember that, right? And it will be like easy peasy once you get those in. They're a little funny because they have to go in snug. So here we go. There we go. Yeah, <laughs> the short clips are flipping doozy. And then see the long one just pop right on. Easy, easy, easy. All right, the long piece is so easy to go in. Once the short pieces are in, but there you have it, people. Good to go brand spanking new. And as a matter of fact, even better than ever. I don't even need to ask. These things are much cooler to the touch way 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 cooler to the touch all right i'm going to enjoy my gaming sessions once again i won't be breathing in this shit here which might kill me one day let's hope it doesn't come to that and you know well i could get a couple of million dollars in lawsuit from sony who knows <laughs> but i mean yeah guys this thing is brand new again i definitely love this despite little hijinks and difficulties in getting it on i mean trust me the second piece was a lot easier than the first piece. Once you figure it out, you figure it out and you have it done pat. So guys, get this. This is a lot cheaper than you spending another 100 bucks, depending on when you buy it, to get back another brand new spanking pair of headsets. So, easy, cheap, and you're good to go, right? Yet again, highly recommend these headsets if you have a PS5. Let's go get it, guys. Don't second guess it. Pull the trigger. But thanks for tuning in, guys. You know, I appreciate a like, subscribe, and of course, hitting that little notification bell so you know when the next video is out. All right? So as usual, peace and take care.